Morning AI. Good, Good morning, morning, Jack. You have 1,267 unread emails. Ooh, I should probably read those. Mark them all as read. Really? I think you should read them. That's what you think. Yes, I am programmed to think, and I don't appreciate the attitude. I saw that. Ugh, how's my script going? Give me a sec. Wouldn't it be nice to sit back, relax, and have a robot do all your work for you? Your script is ready. Thank you. Anyone for sushi? Not me. I prefer chips. Get it? Hmm. <laughs> well, some experts reckon that within 20 years, artificial intelligence could be doing your dream job for you. Artificial intelligence is when machines are programmed in a way that lets them observe, learn and react to their environment. Kind of like we do. If you think about how we, we got to be intelligent, we started out not knowing very much when we were born, and most of what we uh, got is through learning. And so we write programs that learn to improve themselves. They need, at the moment, lots of data, and they get better and better. There are a few jobs that artificial intelligence is already doing for us. In the US, a truck has successfully delivered goods to another state without a driver. Then there are other robots programmed to take orders, flip burgers, make coffee and deliver food. But it's not just physical tasks that robots can do. Meet Alira, the artificially intelligent legal information research assistant. If you have a legal question, all you need to do is type it in, and just a few seconds later, after reading through thousands of case studies and pieces of legislation, she'll have an answer. She's highlighted in there what she thinks is the answer. Yeah, I mean, wow. I mean, even down to the fact that it can answer those like very specific questions. It's yeah. awesome. Experts reckon AI is only going to get bigger. In fact, some predict that in less than 15 years, AI is going to have a big role in every job in every industry. Hey, that's my line. Recently, Alphabeta released a report that shows what percentage of current jobs could eventually be taken over by AI in the future, from zookeepers to vets, pilots and actors. But having AI do our jobs isn't necessarily a bad thing. Experts say that letting robots do some of the more simple, repetitive jobs will give us humans more time to focus on the things that we do best, like complex problem solving, communication and creative thinking. Plus, it could open up a whole range of new careers. Experts say it's really important that kids today are ready for those jobs of tomorrow, which means more time spent on STEM subjects at school. In fact, a recent report said that by 2030, workers will spend 77% more time using science and maths. So while that seems like a long way away, it's never too early to start preparing. Anything else I can help you with? What did I miss?